Hey everybody out there in YouTube land, this is Jake Javarelli of Javarelli.com. Just a bunch of referral links. So today I'd like to talk about OfferWall apps. In particular, CoinSupply and Tip Nano, which I've already reviewed, and Swagbucks. I have been involved with Swagbucks for longer than I've had a YouTube channel, at least this YouTube channel, and I won't dismiss that I have made probably a hundred dollars off of Swagbucks. It, Swagbucks seems to go up and down, but they're really just all the same general kinds of things. I think Swagbucks was one of the first in the mo more recent era. Uh, coin to play is the latest, pays you in crypto, but I want to try to give a level-headed look at this because I've spent a lot of time doing these things and I don't want to give the wrong impression but I also want to give a clear impression of what it is that I think of when I think of offer wall apps so if you don't have and this is your first time checking out my channel um, this is reviews just a bunch of referral links per the name I stated beginning and I review apps my regular viewers would probably be quite aware of this um, trying to get the, the clear picture about what these things do and are now will coin to play or swag bucks or tip nano or any of the probably thousand different apps that will pay you to do these things pay you yes most of them will pay you the question I always have is how much and for how long? Now, a lot of them do tend to stick around. There wouldn't be so many of these alpha wall type apps if they didn't pay because nobody would use them um, and the people who were, who were creating them wouldn't be making any money. So the question in, your, in my mind is, is it worth it? I keep thinking of the YouTube channel worth it when I think of that, but they're doing completely different reviews. Um, in this case, I would say, for me personally, no, it's not really worth it. Did I make money off Swagbucks? Yes. Have I made money off Tip Nemo? Yes. Have I made money off of Coin to Play? Yes. Where's the money really? It's in referrals. Now, I'm only barely three minutes into this video, and I've given you pretty much all you need to know about all offer wall apps, but I'm still going to go into the details of what coin to play offers but before we get to that I'd just like to tell you that I appreciate all the people who are subscribed to my channel and we are giving a, doing a giveaway at 500 nearing on 300 subs right now so I'm expecting that soon hopefully by the end of this month but we'll see honestly if it's by the end of August I won't be disappointed either we'll be giving away 100,000 satoshis 50,000 satoshis and 25,000 satoshis three prizes not one and I am good for it. You guys have seen my uh, Exodus accounts. But I do want to mention, and this is something I only recently found out about, so of course I am telling everyone about it. If you sign up with the referral link, which I have in every one of my videos now in the description, for the Atomic Wallet, they will give you 15 Atomic Wallet coin. And just to interject this really quickly here, I have currently from the last, last month received my 15 Atomic Wallet coin and it's worth $13.42 US. How much is that in Satoshis? It's actually more than my prize. <laughs> I, I did. It wasn't this much when I received it. It was actually a little bit less, but altcoins have been going up lately and that was what one of my video, recent videos about Doge was. So if you sign up with this, you will get more than my prize. So just uh, advice. And, like I said before in all previous videos that where the price was uh, pertinent uh, in order to receive funds from me in the prize once you've subscribed uh, you'll need to have a wallet so if you already have a wallet great give me your Bitcoin address and I'll you'll be entered into the into the prize and of course you still have to be sub but um, if you sign up with atomic wallet you'll just get the money anyways so hey Maybe you'll double your money if you subscribe to my channel. But uh, yeah, Atomic Wallet for the win. Now, let me get back to this. Um, so coin to play. Uh, 
there are a ton of offers similar to swag bucks lots and lots of opportunities to make money but a lot of these offers which the repeatable ones let's see like these ones here this start this offer start this offer these relatively small amounts not these gigantic amounts like 35,000 44,000 um, the small amounts uh, let me use my finger on this because the mouse is slow um, the bonus yeah you can do that fine you get the 5% bonus coin applies free coin spend every day you'll you'll never hardly get anything out of that somewhere between 20 and 50 maybe it's a thousand coins very rarely it's it's just for fun it's just to keep you interested um, the surveys I don't, personally I don't like them now let me just give you a hint if you're Latino or Hispanic they'll love you if you're if you're Latino a background like uh, South middle middle American or South American or just you know uh, Hispanic something like that these survey companies are very interested in you so if you are of that background and can give that kind of information or if you're a young person oh man they'll love you and they'll, you'll make a lot more money off of these survey systems than you will also if you're a woman and you're interested in certain home care or beauty care products those that they're also very much me personally not very interested in me uh, my background my heritage my age group uh, who I am they they just I <laughs> I'll go into a theorem research here or, or um, what's the other one? Oh, pole fish and I never get any surveys and they don't pay me anything so to me it's impractical it's useless why would I bother but if you're of those examples I gave um, I don't know about other cultures if you're European or Indian or Asian I don't know if they'll care as much about you but they don't care about me in my background so I don't tend to do these surveys maybe it makes you more money makes me nothing um, so I just ignore them uh, the daily watch things I hardly pay anything you, you can watch 14 videos for 12 coins each eh, you get more out of some of the single points these things are hardly make anything you could probably get I think the most I've ever gotten out of the uh, pay to click ads was 250 points now before I go into these really really high amounts let me talk about what the points are in this um, the, the, the payout here, this little thing at the top, I don't know if you can see it or not, um, where your points are, are recorded, uh, take this number and uh, put a decimal point, two points in. Uh, and so this is actually showing 11 cents, US dollars, 11 cents. Uh, so a, a thousand points is 10 cents. So if you take that on the same thing here and, and just move the decimal place two points in, or if you use a common, the point is, uh, move this comma down here one and you get how much you get in total pennies. So this exclusive sign up thing here is five dollars, five US dollars roughly. This one's uh, well, actually this one's twenty dollars. But having played Kings of Avalon myself or King of Avalon, I know that getting to uh, level 17 will take a while, like weeks. <laughs> um, one of my favorite games, I figure I'm going to find it in here. I actually played this a while ago with a different app to make money uh, yeah here we go coin master I've beat coin master I've got the, one of the highest levels you could possibly get they want you to get to level three village three that if you play every single day and don't pay them any money will probably take you a week to get that far I've done it multiple times I actually like coin master it's a fun game I, I think um, Devin Scrabble I've never actually gotten to level 15 so I have no idea I, I would estimate that any one of these things if you don't pay money to get that and of course if you're trying to make money why would you pay money right if you're trying to do it the free way going the, the least expensive way so you actually get all the money you can these sorts of things actually are not easy to do um, and that's on purpose right maybe you, you would like playing this game maybe you wouldn't it's hard to say but uh, in order to complete some of them some of them are actually impossible to complete in the time that they allot you so it's they're gonna make money on it no matter what and that's really the point uh, they wouldn't be doing these things and offering them to you if they were making nothing and even so like this discover today that's not even it's not even once it's no it's one cent 1.2 cents is basically what they're paying on this one thing 1.2 cents 1.2 cents all these different things if you did all of them yeah you might you might be able to you but the question for me comes down to is it worth your time and is it worth your money as i said in the beginning for me it's not um for people like uh other youtubers that I know that ever advertise these little apps it's really more about the affiliate marketing that the referral links per my channel name where the actual money comes in and so if you're good at referring people 
I'm not even all that good at it. I have had many referrals to my channel and through the, all the people who've watched and and even subscribers. But um, I know people who are far more successful about this, like those you know, the people who do the, the giveaways for credit cards, um, that get you know free flights around the world. Those people are far more successful. And of course, they also have tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands, of subscribers to their channel. So I'm not anywhere close to that at this point. Um, and so I guess what I'm trying to get at with these these uh, offer wall things for me not worth it for you it might be and so if this is, is of interest to you then i would say give it a shot i mean who am i to judge your perspective i have no idea unless you tell me what your situation is and maybe you'll be enjoying this application maybe it's fun like i said i've already said about um uh coin master i actually liked that game one of the other um, pay-to-play games that I really liked was Idle Golf. Uh, Idle Golf pays you nothing. I actually got hooked on it from another game that told me to play it for money. I got $10 for having played the game for a week. And then uh, I continued to play Idle Golf thereafter. I actually read, found it rather fun, um, even though it paid me nothing after that. So I would say if, if this is of interest to you, cool. Thumbs up. But if... If it's not making you money or if you realize after doing it for a week or two that you really only made like a buck you know one us dollar or so then i i wouldn't blame you if you just said no or in this case you know however many it's satoshis it paid out then you go back to something like crypto tab without the boost i've had a lot of questions about that lately that they're like hey where did my cloud boost go or hey um i can't get the cloud boost to show up or something of that sort i i wish i could help you guys more with that i'm not in control of cloud boost I'm not in control of Super Boost or even CryptoTab, and I've sent them questions. I've asked them, hey, why is this not working? And they give me no answer. It's kind of a use at your own risk. And I hate to say that about the apps I use. I would want to be as honest as possible about coin applier, swag bucks, and things like that. These are my actual literal examples. This is what's happened to me. I don't trust CryptoTab anymore, so I don't really use it. And I feel bad that I've led a lot of people into finding interest in it. It will still make you money. You, you can use the non cloud boost. Heck, you can even use the cloud boost version of it and get more money than you put into it. But of course, the cloud boost feature has to not disappear. <laughs> and I'm sorry that it has done that for, for, for some of my viewers. Um, but it's not, it's a little, how do I put it? Not untrustworthy, but a little suspect. Yeah, it's a little suspect. It's a little like, mm, I don't know if that's really true. You know, you might be lying. And it sucks when they offer these great things and then they just take your money, right? Like a high yield investment program. You don't know if it's gonna work, it's just a gamble. If it does, great, most likely it won't. And that really does suck. Um, so yes, coin to play pays. Yes, swag bucks pays. Yes, Nat tip nano pays. They don't pay very much, but they do pay. Now I wanna make a point before I end this video about one of my favorite apps. Um, let's see if I have it here. Give me a second to find it. Um, I have a bunch of, bunch of other apps on my phone I don't really want to show. So let's pull this up. All right. Um, yeah, you can see my total up here at the top, 95.79. Uh, you get 100 points every single time you play this game. I like Solitaire. I would play Solitaire even if they didn't pay me. And I have played Solitaire many, many times when I wasn't being paid for it. So the fact that uh, Bling Games pays me one cent per uh, game I play of, well, slightly more than a cent, but roughly that. And it does pay out in, in crypto, in Bitcoin. But I guess what I'm trying to get at is I'm getting paid to play a game I enjoy. So if you guys like it, and it, I don't have a referral for this, you can just check it out in the link below. Um, if you want to be paid to play Bling Games, you can play all these games. They have a limit. You can only play like three hours worth of games and then they stop you and they can't play for 12 hours. I played, uh, I think the first time I played uh, this, I played it, what, almost 400 times before I cashed out. And when I cashed out, I got like, what was it, four bucks? Yeah, so not a whole lot. Uh, in any case, it's it's a pittance of a payment for what you're getting uh, for, for doing it. But if you like the thing, like, like the example back here, with um, coin to play, then what am I to stop you? I'm just telling you about this this interesting program. So, um, yeah, coin to play is another offer wall program. 
I do, I'll link also Tip Nana below. I did Tip Nana for a while. I think I made a, what, 10,000 Satoshis out of Tip Nano from doing their stuff. And I will make a note that if you do multiple uh, offer wall programs and use the things that are like these, um, these offer wall ones that I don't do, um, they take you to an external site. And uh, if you've completed all the surveys on CoinTapply and then you go and use TipNano to get to get something like Theorem Research, like this, this application here, it takes you to the same site. And so if you've already completed all those research uh, surveys, you won't be able to do any more that day. So make sure you pick the offer wall program that you want to be paid out in because unless you change, let's say, IPs or something like that, which is one way of tricking the system, I guess, um, then the system will like, oh, you've already answered all the surveys you can't take anymore. So just be aware of that. If you're doing multiple offer walls and you're using these similar research programs, once you've done all the pro programs, you won't be able to do any more with a different app. You can't just play the system that way. The only way I think to get around it is to have multiple phones, multiple IP addresses, multiple Wi-Fi's or whatever. That's the only way to get around it. Um, it it's almost more work than it's worth, in my opinion. Uh, so, in any case, uh, yeah, not. I'm not. I do these things still. It's kind of just a minor distraction. I hate to put it this way, but it's a great thing to do while sitting on the pot, the commode, the john. The crapper, yeah. Um, I hope that makes sense. Um, <laughs> sometimes you're watching videos, and sometimes you're doing surveys. <laughs> so, uh, anyways, I, I didn't want to come off like I did negatively with the Tip Nano app. Yes, I still do Tip Nano. Yes, I still do swag bucks, but I don't do surveys because they don't like my demographic. So, if it's all for you, thumbs up on the video. Please tell me your experience about uh, your. Uh, having used these awful roll apps if you just if you know of other ones i'm interested not doing surveys but interested in what they have to offer if there's other more interesting things to do in those applications for the most part they're all the same it's just a question of what you want to be paid in tip nano do you want to be paid in nano do you want to be paid in bitcoin do you want to be paid in us dollars to paypal yeah there's lots of different options um i i want crypto so um anyways i'm going to make another video back to this one so thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one